timeline that that generation is working towards is again optimized for offspring and the uh, the grandparents strength to raise them because you don't right. so this is the first kind of marriage you are talking about the first it is not about you it is not about him it's not about whether you're sexually compatible it's not about if you're whether you're sexually satisfied because they think that this container will work itself out over a period of time maybe it does maybe it does. but that container itself has a lot of holes in it and it didn't two or three generations ago right like that's what yeah. i'm saying there this this idea that you have your whole life to figure things out comes mm. from that belief you have to understand this is why there is a lot of pressure right, mm. right? because of this primacy a uh, religious need to you know have children and settle down so that you can the family is settled right um and that religious role the man can then assume his full religious role in the hierarchy that's what all of this is about right and, yes. and uh, you know it, only if you're married you can light the fire for example right so if the dad is getting older they have to get you married because what if i die and then you can't uh, you know so it is not about you and him and your it's not your day at all right it is hmm. look at our marriage rituals right it is everything but the couple right It yeah. is about everybody getting together. The family is proving, hey, look, you know, I kept the girl a virgin. You know, I got her married to the same caste, and I did my role, and yeah, whatever else, right? 